Sample HTST Reference Guide. The hot water set supplies the heater section with the hot water to heat the product. The process water valve supplies water to the balance tank for startup and cleaning. The raw milk pump supplies raw product to the balance tank. The balance tank inlet throttling valve holds the balance tank at a constant level. The balance tank maintains a near constant level, so the booster pump or stuffing pump will have a consistent inlet suction pressure at all time. The regenerator bypass valve is de-energized and feeds the stuffing pump when in diverted flow. The stuffing pump feeds the homogenizer slash timing pump at the required flow and pressure to ensure no air leaks into the cylinders on the suction stroke. The timing device can be a positive displacement pump or a centrifugal pump connected to a magnetic flow meter to ensure that the product will never flow through the holding tube in less than 15 seconds on milk and 25 seconds on ice cream. The homogenizer is a high pressure pump which forces a product through a small gap to break up the fat globules in the raw product so that they will not cling together and float to the top of the container when pasteurized. The pressure relief valve protects the plate heat exchanger from the high pressure of the timing pump if a valve is closed downstream, the cooler section freezes up, or there is too much burn on in the heater section. The heater section heats the product 10 to 12 degrees per pass. That is why it runs in diverted flow for 8 to 10 minutes to reach forward flow temperature. Once in forward flow, the regenerator preheats the product, allowing the heater section to supply the last 10 to 12 degrees. The holding tube is where pasteurization occurs. This is where the product is held for the legal holding time at the legal temperature. The digital reference thermometer monitors the temperature at the end of the holding tube. It is the legal and official temperature of the product. The flow divert valve is de-energized when product temperature is below pasteurization temperature, so the product will return to the balance tank in diverted flow. The sight glass in the leak detect line monitors the condition of the flow divert valve while the HTSD is in diverted flow. If product is seen in the sight glass, it is an indication that the flow divert valve is leaking out the top port, allowing raw product into the pasteurized side of the HTST. Here is a diverted flow reference list. JY Enterprises is now proud to offer an animated reference guide constructed from your HTSCP and ID in diverted, flush, forward, and recycle flow. For more information, please contact us at joewhite at jyenterprises.com.